going to disable Noble for a couple of seconds here. It turns their fast push into an immediate slow push. Now they have to decide. Look at Koala. How did that happen? From the smoke comes the Roomba. And takes down uh, one member for first blood. That's an unfortunate loss for Noble coming into this round here. They're going to want to try and take that back by uh, pushing in aggressively. Here they come. Oh, oh, the right clicks of the Classic are coming out. And Koala nets himself two kills, at least in the round itself. And now he says to the rest of his team, you guys need to clean up for me. Noble, they make their way over onto the site. King is going to be in a 1v1 versus Governor, but Zekin is able to take him down. Inside of Vents as well. The Jiggle P comes out. Head taps. <laughs> Zekin lands it. If anyone's going to land it, it's going to be Zekin. Last member hiding inside of Hookah is going to be flashed right on out. And through the wall, he's taken down a 4k now for Zekin. Coming into round number one. That is huge. Noble starting out as they mean to finish this one off. They only need one map and they're going to really, really push on this one. Because even losing a member straight away to a... Uh, uh, a boom bot there, interestingly. Uh, they still managed to clutch that one out. Uh, getting site control quite decisively. And managing to uh, pick everybody off. Koala, only, the only person getting a pick on the easy five side. And now they're going to buy up into this round. Look to take that second round back. And then maybe the That'd third round after that one. That would be nice. <laughs> Winning rounds is always really good. Do you have a little oh. bit of pre-firing shots that are going through? Menace right through the smoke. I feel like it doesn't even phase me anymore. Blind shots through smokes have been going on this whole entire tournament. And uh, now at this point, Governor, no one checked that corner over by double stack. And he just right clicks twice and takes down two members now. Easy five are in a 2v2 situation, which is, which is exactly what they want to look for. But Noble, they still, got, they still have the Spectres. Yeah, Noble got punished a little bit for that sloppy play coming Cover, into the site, but now in 2v2. They just want to finish off this round. Uh, they have a completely different goal coming into this one than easy. Oh. Do you have the Marshall play now for Gucci? He wants to look for the no scopes, and he's not able to find the kill itself, but was able to find the shot. Two quick kills coming through for Noble as they take their second round here of this match. And now is where Easy 5 need to win the third round in a uh, at least the third round here of this half. Because if they don't, it gets really scary for them. Yep, absolutely. That round was a, a success for both teams. Actually, they both achieved exactly what they wanted to. Noble got the mm -hmm. uh, round win. And uh, Easy Five got the uh, economic, uh, you know, kind of taking away weapons from the Noble side that they they wanted to do coming into that round. Now, wow, both teams have got an interesting little buy. Uh, Easy Five definitely with more weapons. Ooh, the immediate rush onto the site is going to be Menace, but Menace, he has the judge for himself, and he completely lays down the law as he takes down two, and now for the third for himself, as he picks up a Phantom, but headshot is going to be Leviathan onto Menace inside of Heaven. Easy five are left in a 2v4 situation as the spike ends up going down from Noble, and they go into their post-plant positions. This is an absolute nightmare here for Easy Five. Losing the third round is a real blow. And they're actually going to try and save up those uh, more expensive yeah. weapons that they bought up here. That's really going to uh, put a damper on their plans coming into the the later rounds of this half. Because winning the third round after winning the first two rounds is a massive advantage coming into this first half. I'm just taking the portal as they get away from the spike. There is two members of EZ5 that are hiding inside of Hookah. If anything happens, they have the crossfire. No one wants to contest just yet. And just as I say that, King is taken out. Oh, Precision almost had it. But that's three rounds in a row that go over to Noble's favor. And now EZ5, some of their members can full buy. I don't think that N4STV can, though. Yeah, this is difficult now for uh, Easy Easy Five. It's it, it's it's a difficult situation to be in because, uh, yeah, forcing up into this one is actually I think the choice you would make because um, although it puts you at risk of losing more rounds, you really do need to tear these weapons away from uh, Noble yeah. now because otherwise they're going to run away with that economic advantage. 
as they push in here aggressively. Noble's lead here in this match is just looks so good. Oh, the updraft came through with the blade storm and didn't find anybody. Menace was known to play the Viper, was known to play the Jets, and here in this last best of three grand finals game point match wants to pull out his tried and true hiding behind here this little container just jumps for a second place is down the cloud burst but just a little bit too late as n4 picks up one but this jangler inside a cubby now picking up two of his own governor does take that last one now but it's gonna be the spike that was trying to go down but look at this clinic that is being applied here on the site that's four rounds in a row from noble and the force from easy five is not able to pay off that's gonna be heartbreaking for easy five because now their worst fears are coming to fruition they're gonna to have to really save up into this next round to even have a chance of buying against them but they're already four rounds down and noble have that bankroll that they can use to uh support them if they start to lose rounds coming into this one but it looks like they're probably gonna go five nil up coming into this half oh that is that is heartbreaking especially when you're playing defense you want to get those rounds on defense on blind yeah. Yeah, it's those rounds that you force that you want to grab the kills for. Governor, we're not going to talk about that as he dashes in and tries to make a play. And he sadly fails to do so. Now there's only two members left of Easy 5 remaining here. Just tax textbook style Noble is coming through in this round and just taking the opponents down one by one, not giving them any chance to headshot or anything like that. Precision precision just in case wants to catch anybody rotating but it's just going to be the members of easy five that are over on a noble wanting to make sure that they get as many credits as possible there's going to be a 1v1 that's sitting inside of lamps and uh <laughs> ends up losing the 1v1 king takes down gucci as well with the headshot and it's just going to be a 1v1 here that uh Koala is able to win. Koala wins two 1v1s in a row and now just wants to try and save this phantom however possible. Yeah, although well, moving towards the spike, maybe not a good idea if you're trying to save. <laughs> He's going to be pitched down here. Oh. Ah, there it is. But I think in general, honestly, that was a misplay from Noble. What is going on, guys? Come on, I know you have the money, but you can't be losing those weapons like that. You know, the the, op the easy five only had sheriffs coming into that round. They knew that after they won those three engagements at the start of the round. So maybe hunting people down and losing three agents on that one is not a good idea, especially uh, when you know easy five are trying their best to get into this one. You don't want to. You want to keep that that economy up. You're not at your economy cap yet. Try and get as much as you can yeah. before uh, easy five try and get back into this game. But either way, it doesn't really matter for them too much. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I got excited. But uh, uh, Menace, I love how he's just choosing the, the judge here just to get onto the site and just take down whoever he can. And now just save as many credits as possible and also try and swing. He's end up, he ends up picking up one, but doesn't realize that there's one more inside of this elbow type of area. Koala picks up now three over on the site. This is a turn of events that we didn't think that would happen. A triple kill going over to Koala and just needs to continue to clear out the site. Hits himself with his own paint shell but wow. the 4k goes out for for koala as easy five pick up their first round here of the half noble doing a great job only problem is, is that you ran into a koala and he wasn't lazy yeah koala really taking matters into his own hands in that round taking four kills and closing that one out and uh you know noble did play it well i think menace a good pick with the judge there the jet and the judge really do go hand in hand uh, with the uh, movement abilities, being able to get in close and get those picks. Uh, but in the end, Koala, just with the, uh, with the impeccable aim, able to uh, close that one out. And now they're feeling, eh, well, the pressure's still on for them. They're still low on economy. They're still four rounds down. So they really do need to keep this momentum up. But for them, it's way. a little less daunting. Going to be the blade gun that comes through now for a minute. Not going to be the jet play that we have usually seen, but Zekin uses at least one satchel charge to get onto the site. A lot of uh, coverage going down here on this default type of area if they want to plant down the spike in this area. The only thing is, is that no kills have gone back and forth just yet. And that's exactly what Noble need in order to find their advantage. The healing is going to be able to come out at least from Sky. And now the attack onto backside is going to be real. Koala, he picks up one headshot onto Jangler. 
which is a great pick so far for easy five he's got a short second he gets pre-fired and he didn't really even realize that he was gonna he was getting pre-fired precision he's got a couple but it doesn't even matter because easy five have round one two in a row my goodness they look so good yeah, and now the pressure is off for Easy 5. They can relax a little bit more. They've stabilized everything going into this next round. Noble are going to have to spend a lot of their economy getting those weapons, whereas uh, Easy 5 are building up that economy, being able to uh, keep this one going. And you can see it's pretty even now going into this round, obviously apart from the round difference. So, good now. Koala, Koala Noob really, uh, really taking matters into his own hands again that round and uh, really uh, you know, showing us that they're not out of the game yet. You know, just because they lose the first five rounds does not mean that they're yeah. going to lose this game. It just looks so good. My goodness, Governor. Making a new law in his town. He's just taking down one more. Remember? Oh, that collab was so <laughs> close. Oh, my God. Goodness. Menace takes down one over on B site, and it almost turned into a collateral. Absolutely, very, very almost, but they have evened it out with that one, and they're going to move towards A to try and get a little more momentum pushing forward. There's only two people uh, defending this site, and as they go for this split here, Menace is going to take bathrooms, everyone else is going to take short. Here they go. Camera taken out. It's going to be a push that goes through inside of A short, just like you said, as the cage is end up going out there is no sage available but he could be coming out for Spike nasty he's a. got one trade of kills goes down as well but it is just going to be the plant that comes through you also hear oh my goodness you hear the showstopper and king gets taken down he is able to plant down the spike but two members are left of noble one of them with an operator, so it's really good. Pre-fire goes out. Can he flick over towards the head of Koala? But no, he cannot. Easy five. My goodness, three in a row. Wow. Easy five are definitely uh, coming back with a vengeance now. They're not going down without a fight. They have uh, not even using a tactical pause to get this momentum back. They've just turned it back around. I think maybe Noble being a bit, a bit complacent or something has happened. Now they're going to have to really think about their plays as they're going into this round with a bit of a lower economy. And they're going to have to really uh, consolidate their attacks and uh, maybe think about what they're doing a little more. We'll see what Noble can do here in this map number one of this best of three. They took five in a row. Five rounds in a row. And sadly, at least for Noble, sadly... Oh, yeah. They cannot find a six. It's three rounds in a row that are going right on over to easy five. And I love seeing these underdogs pull up and just be able to square up. We do have Koala yeah, as absolutely. well checking inside of Hookah. Sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead, yeah, no, but absolutely. It is, it is good to see the uh, underdogs coming through and the showstopper doesn't find anything. But uh, they're going to get site control here and another pick's coming out. They are doing very well now, easy five, to take back map control. Take back map, and map control. It's exactly what Easy 5 need to do here. The grenade goes out over by the defender spawn and tags a couple of members. I also do have the paranoia that went out. The pre-firing shots went down. The blaze storm actually ended up missing. King picks up two now towards the back of the site. We need to watch if Governor can land the shots. No, he cannot. And it's just going to be Zekin that lands the last one onto Leviathan's head. Noble, they pull through six to three here in this match, finally finding their sixth round here on attack. Second really found himself in the face of the uh, <laughs> the Matrix set there as Governor turned around the yeah. corner with the Blade Storm, dodging absolutely every one of them by sweeping wow. around the corner just in time. But uh, yeah, Noble did so well to lock down that site there. They've really. Uh, uh, I mean, they did so well to just kind of stop the momentum that, uh, that Easy 5 had going on there and uh, just try and pull this one back. And they actually really have. You know, you can see the economy. After winning three rounds, Easy 5 should really have better economy, but they've been losing so many players in each of the rounds that it's difficult for them to keep that one up. Yeah, we have to watch if, um, if Easy 5, you know, can't lose any more members. And, um, they, they, you know, honestly, like, 
Noble have done just such a good job of spreading their men across this map. And, and finding the picks wherever possible. Oh, Menace. Looked for a flick. And he couldn't find it. He had the right idea, though. But it just sends Noble towards the other side of the map. Now where they will run into this jet player hugging inside a long. Yeah. Very good. Ooh, good trade, though. Yeah. Yeah, it's a one-for-one yeah, one trade that goes down inside job, of... But, uh... Sorry, my bad. <laughs> it's the delay. It's the EU to NA delay. Yeah. Unfortunate. It's okay. It we have Zekin that got his way towards the back of the site. Then we also have Gucci. He's sitting backside as well with left. the rest of his allies. Noble, as well as Easy Five. They're both looking for their first advantage here, and Noble are able to find it first. Oh, my man. goodness, Zekin. Two kills in a row, as well as the Jet. Taking up one more for herself. Sitting at 5 HP is going to be Zekin, but he has a, a whole a whole team in order to help him out here. And it's just going to be running for the hills uh, is, is the raise player over on Easy 5. Yeah, I think he wants to save anything he can on this round, but it's going to be so difficult pushing into CT. I think he's going to be met by Jet here. Yeah. Ooh, gets the kill. That's good. That's Koala. Absolutely. Yeah, Koala <laughs> yeah and absolutely, yeah. Doing a good job to save that Vandal because uh, that's going to come in very handy coming into the next round. I mean, uh, Noble have already won the half technically with the seven rounds, and uh, that's great for them. Obviously, they only need to one, win one map. I, guess we, I know we keep harping on about that, but it's so uh, it's so important coming into them, especially right. like mentally for both teams. They know that Noble only need to uh, win this one map, and that and for that for uh, Easy Five is uh, a big driving force in how they're going to play this game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, easy five. They have to find their advantage that they found in the three rounds that they ended up winning. Their defense in those rounds was so good. The problem here is, is I don't know if these way. phantom buys are any good for this squad. Maybe they just want to full on save and just and and use their advantage next round to find something, but. You can see here that the push is coming through as Noble. They find their advantage on the site, but Koala, my goodness. It's a trade of one-for-one one kills over on the site, but the, at the end of the day, Easy 5 are left with one member down inside of Heaven as well. Governor able to take down one inside of a short. The spike itself has gone down. What can Governor do here? He can land a headshot! That was sick, man! Precision now facing off his opponent, Leviathan, in a 1v1. One sitting inside of Lamps. One's going to be sitting inside of Default. Shock Dart goes out and only lands a little bit of damage. Leviathan, my goodness. He's able to find that peak and takes his team up. Wow. Only closing the gap by three. Easy 5 did so well there with the lower economy and almost no weapons to speak of, actually. To take that round out, Governor coming through with the pocket orb almost through on A short. <laughs> getting those headshots, absolutely brilliant. And uh, that's that's going to give them the uh, momentum they need, probably. Obviously, uh, uh, Noble is still going to be able to buy up. They did have enough economy after that round to do that. But now, at least, uh, Easy 5 can buy up into this last round of the half and possibly make it a 5-7. This is exactly what they need because, as I've talked about earlier, Noble do have a very good track record on defense bind, so they want to get as many rounds as they can this half. You see the double peak coming out inside a long, but it doesn't really matter for the time being because the push is going to be right onto A site with the first blood going on inside of bathrooms. Beautiful job by King. Menace is able to dash onto the back of the site like he usually does. You also see the TP potentially going to be coming out here and it does end up uh, getting taken now with a quick oh, couple nice. of taps over towards the head king now finding another one And it's gonna be three members of easy five that have fallen here in the last round of the half Yeah, and just as I said that uh, easy five were looking like they were gonna be able to uh, finish this one up five seven Oh, maybe they still can but it's looking unlikely for these guys definitely steep mountain to climb We've seen it before with the shock darts going out as well. The recon bolt towards the top of the site just to scout out the whole entire site. Leviathan, he's got the peak available for himself, but it's going to be the blind that ends up taking him out at the end of the day. And it's just pre-firing shots towards the spike as well. That was very, very close with the defuse going out. 
But Switching sides. at the end of the day, Noble, eight, easy five. They've got four. Yeah, nice tries, nice tries, nice tries for easy, easy five there. Uh, as they got very close to defusing that one, obviously with the time pressure, it's going to be very difficult. Uh, you know, coming up against three players of Noble there, and uh, in the end, they've done as much as they can in that one. But uh, eight four to Noble is going to, uh, it's looking, uh, it's looking painful right now for uh, for easy five. They're really going to need to turn up the uh, turn up the pressure, turn up the heat as they come into this round. And, Try and get this one back because this map means everything to them right now. Yeah, it's the pistol round, right? And uh, when you when you you speak about that, easy five have to win this round at least. The thing is, is that if they don't, that is a very interesting scenario to oh talk about. Whoa! Come on. It doesn't display as a headshot. But it looked like a headshot, and it sounded like yeah, a headshot. Uh, I think it was a right click. It's... One of them hit the head, one of them hit the neck. Some, yeah, something happened there, but at the end of that trade, Easy 5 still have four members remaining as Noble. They're looking to make their way onto the site and take down a couple. Oh, they've already got one, and that's really good. 75 HP is going to be Zekin. I was going to say, if there's any player to land headshots, it's going to be Zekin. He's got the boom bot available. It gets used out over towards Garden now. It does get activated, and now Zekin wants to get aggressive. He might want to try and attack here inside of Garden. It's a very weird position to be in, but it's going to be this type of pinching type of position where N4 is going to be able to pick up one. Koala lands the third kill for himself of the round. Easy five. Great job winning the pistol. Yeah, absolutely. When you're in that post-plant position and you have control of B long there, it's so difficult to do anything, especially with the man disadvantage, and the, they knew they couldn't really push anything there, so they kind of just sat outside and waited for any information they could get. Unfortunately, uh, Easy 5 were very clinical and not giving up information. Koala Noob is really taking this game by the reins. Look at him, 18 and 8 yeah. uh, already, yeah. and now they're going to come into this round with SMGs. He's doing an absolute great job here in this match. He is carrying his team on his back and does not want to lose this match. It's a difference of $1,000, right? And if you're in that type of position, you want to try and win. The rush ends up coming through from Noble, but they aren't able to land literally any kills. They are able to land... Oh my goodness, Governor! Wow. He follows him. Hunts him down. A great display of action coming through from wow. easy five an easy round for them as well they take their sixth round here of this game and they are only now two rounds down on their opponents noble again on paper noble are supposed to win this round if they do not then uh the game might as well just be tied up yeah, absolutely. I mean, Noble went into that round thinking, okay, guys, we need to just... I think we need to just push up and try and get as many kills as possible. It doesn't matter if we lose this one, so they went for it. Uh, unfortunately, not finding anything, but they're going to be able to buy up into this next round now. Noble really want to win this one um, to stop the opposite happening of what happened last half with the uh, five rounds to them. It's a slow push that's coming out now for Easy 5 and just as I say that, they want to get onto the site as absolutely fast as possible. Zekin picks up one, picks up two, he doesn't pick up a third, but King is there to at least trade a little bit. The portal ends up getting used on both sides of the map. Whoa. The only thing is, is that there is an Omen player that's sitting inside a cubby. If they don't check the corner, he could be taking him out and he does it in a style. My goodness, Jangler, a great... Great two kills for him over on the site. Yeah, I think... Well, the thing is, right, sometimes you feel like you are under time pressure when you're running away from a site. Even though uh, Easy 5 weren't actually under any time pressure, they had plenty of time to get onto that site and uh, take it slowly. Sometimes uh, you, you kind of get caught up in the moment and you push through. You've, you've, you've just got away from like the, the frying pan and you're jumping straight into the fire, uh, figuratively. And uh, Jangler taking advantage of that just kind of takes an off position makes sure he uh, he takes them out before they check the corner very good and uh yeah as we expected the 2-1 uh, on this half and now noble want to just try and take control back 
We do have the round here starting in round number 16 of this okay. match. Noble, nine. Easy, five, six. Noble, if they win this match, that's it. They go home. They win this grand finals. A best of three. Where Noble won the winner's bracket. So they get a 1-0 advantage on their opponents. And now you can see Easy 5 resting here inside of a short. And they don't want to just yet. And just as I say that, the body of Jangler gets launched. But it's going to be second. He was tagged and he pulls out his grenade. So he does end up getting traded as well. Not the best situation for Noble as they are down by one man. Oh but just God. as I Five say that, Menace, eight. he peeks and he makes it. Left. A three versus three over by default. Still, Leviathan is here. He wants to plant down the spike. Governor, he's able to get, get three kills way. over by Lamps. King, he's also looking for his own advantage one here. You remains. do have him dashing on out of here. King, oh, he's got the amazing. flick available. King, mow him down. Flick right on over to bathrooms. You pulled Noble right on over to double digits oh a master class there from both uh from both king and from uh, the jet player i can't remember his name i'm so sorry <laughs> it's, uh, it's, late, <laughs> it's okay it? my memory is failing menace. me but uh, menace that's the one obviously everybody's been talking about it but uh yeah yep. absolutely brilliant from menace the timing perfect on both kills they're coming out of bathroom stopping the defu uh, stopping the plant sorry and then uh switching back round and getting that uh kill onto the second planter who was flashed and then king with the little the little flick over onto bathrooms there, beautiful from him too, and yeah, coming up 10, 6 now, and uh, Easy 5 don't have the economy the to do this there. one. Governor, as well as, <laughs> well, both Jets kind of pull the exact same type of play when, they're t when you're talking about A short. They both dash and updraft, and uh, sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. That's a play where it doesn't work. Easy five, they tried for their attack. And since they do have to save here in this round, it didn't really end up working. However, just as I say that, Leviathan does have an operator which he has used multiple times in a row. And he's left in a 2v3 situation where he's peeking and gets taken out inside of heaven. Jangler got so scared there because he saw an operator second lands the last one we're on to 11 to 6. if there's a time to call attack pause now is the time mm. gucci actually just yeah second telling gucci there you deserve to kill me gucci did land that headshot before zekken uh shot mm. at him there but uh unfortunately uh just taking him down to about uh, 5 hp there didn't wow. quite finish the job so that is unfortunate for him but um Oh, Noble. Noble are doing so well now, and they can really close this one out. It's uh, it's looking really, really difficult now for uh, Easy 5 and uh, I hate to say it, but uh, Noble are looking like they're coming into this one, trying to close it out. Oof. Yeah, Menace one for one. Over inside of Bathrooms. You do have Koala as well. It does have the Showstopper available. If he wants to use it over on A site, that would be the time. There's also a lot of members over on Easy 5 that are targeting more so over towards long. And I think the rotation is going to be called. There's only two more members of Noble that are left over on B. The advantage is in the hands of Precision. He has a lot of utility. And he knows what's going on here. The flash ends up going out, but he ends up getting paranoia. The snipe from Zekin, though, is way too strong. The ultimate comes through from Sky to back up those opponents inside of bathrooms. One ends up taking the TP, and two do not. No rotation coming out just yet. Zekin with one more inside of Garden. Does the Omen TP, or does he TP Last out of the TP standing. and fake the TP? <laughs> That's a lot of TP. Uh, it does. It doesn't look yeah. like it. <laughs> He's just going to push through here. And uh, <laughs> Zekken is watching, waiting. Komiz are waiting. Gucci takes a pick down there onto Precision, and he's going to get the spike down. Oh, no. Sorry. Alt back over to uh, A site and gets a spike down over there. In a 3v1 yeah. retake, this is going to be difficult for the guy. And he's in lamps. Um, so there's one angle that he has to peek from. Oh, Land the headshot. He's got one. Gucci. 
Looking over towards heaven, and he walks right into the operator. That's gonna be round number 12, or the 12th round over to Noble, which means this is match point. Yeah, and uh, you do hate to see it from easy five there because they're gonna come into this round at an economic disadvantage. Uh, I think they're gonna barely get buys out. Uh, maybe we'll see in a sec. They are getting some vandals, but they've got. Oh, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong side. Oh no, I'm not looking <laughs> at the wrong side. They are gonna get some vandals, but they're also going to look at judges here. And ooh, it's gonna be. We've seen it happen. We've seen it happen so many times. Yeah. I, I, I keep saying it's going to be so difficult and then something happens. So this time I'm not yep. going to say it. And I'm going to leave it to speak for itself. Okay. We'll see what happens with no predictions coming on from our color caster. It's also 5, like 5.30. So I don't blame you whatsoever. Like that. Men. <laughs> Menace. Headshot. <laughs> I didn't mean to blame you. But... <laughs> Menace. He does land Ooh. one governor towards the back of the site. That's huge. Governor ends up landing two, but Noble, they want to keep the site. Leviathan with the Hunter's Fury lands two as well. My goodness. An absolute <sighs> clinic being placed here on the site. Noble King. You go, King. He wants it. He wants that W. He already starts the preemptive rotation. Yeah, yeah he wants <laughs> He wants the preemptive rotation. Oh, oh, he got the tripwire. He could make his it. way onto the site. He could find the sight line. Wow, He's got the camera down. as well. Knows exactly where he is. Hiding right here behind safe. Look for the peak. Look for the peak. Oh, oh that was close. Oh, Leviathan oh, peaks way. it. Leviathan Such peaks it. Yeah. Oh. Wow, such a brilliant play from Leviathan using the uh, using the recon dart as a you know kind of double-edged sword. There, not only is it a distraction, but uh, if he didn't, you know, you know, damned if you do, damned if you don't. King shooting the uh, the recon arrow has to make the long flick over to uh, over to <coughs> excuse me, uh, Leviathan there to finish that one off, and that's also difficult. But uh, you know, if he didn't shoot it, his position's revealed. So. Either way, Leviathan was in a winning position there, which is such a good play to turn it around. Oh, wow. Oh, Koala making his way into Lamps, but he does get taken down by the opposing Rays. It's Zekin. Gets him taken down. Noble now. Oh, they're not sitting in a good position. It's a 3v3. I say that, but it's, it's an even ground, but it just looks like the momentum from EZ5 looks way too strong. Yeah, they're coming into these. Look at this flank coming out now through mid. Oh, sees it coming, Menace. But he's going to get taken out anyway. It's an anime battle at the end of the day as Menace does not land the last one. Now it's all up to Leviathan. Here inside a short, it's a 2v1 battle. Recon bolt inside a lamps. The blind comes up, but he blinds himself. He ends up wide swinging. Pr uh, precision. He needs to land his last kill, and he does it. He clutches up the round. My goodness, Noble. Precision's got it, and he defuses the spike with enough time remaining. Noble are your boom proving grounds champions. Oh, wow, well done there to Noble, closing that one out in a quite spectacular fashion, honestly. And Easy 5 you know, they did, there was some positive moments from Easy 5 for sure there, but they honestly did the whole time look like uh, Noble did have their